Hi guys, welcome to the video. It's Tuesday and uh, this Tuesday I just wanted to do a lesbian book review because for the longest time I've kind of wanted to do something that's like a, a lesbian book club but online. So it's like a regular book club just, just without the awkwardness and the cardigans. No, it still has the awkwardness. Cool. Yeah, cool. So the book I want to talk about today is Sarah Waters' The Paying Guest. Fun fact, I actually saw her once at the Diva Awards and I I should have I should have hit on her. I should have done, but I I didn't because Rachel Shelley was in the room and Rachel Shelley touched touched my elbow, but that that's another story. I couldn't put this book down. I am not exaggerating. This is my favorite novel of hers so far. I've yet to read any other novels, bar Tipping the Velvet and Half of Fingersmith. I was completely sucked in and it's quite a big novel as you can see. It's not just like a quick short read. I was really hooked and it's just incredible. To give you a quick synopsis, it's about this woman called Frances who lives with her mother and they're going Going through financial difficulties so they have to take in lodgers and then this married couple comes to live with them Mr. and Mrs. Barber and Mrs. Barber and Francis get acquainted and you know I don't want to ruin anything but also it's a Sarah Waters novel so you can kind of guess the direction it's set in the 1920s in South London and it is both a romance and a crime novel so just bear that in mind the ending I wasn't so I'm un satisfied with the ending. I kind of want her to write a sequel to this. I don't think she will. Again, without giving anything away, it's not an unhappy ending. I just wasn't satisfied with the ending. I wanted more. I just, no, I just, I really genuinely loved it. If you've read this book, let me know what you think about it in the comments. It's very difficult to give a review without giving away too many spoilers for those of you who haven't read it, but I've just, I can't wait to read more of her stuff. This has kind of rekindled my love for her and look at that face that's the face of someone who is living the dream oh. when I have read enough of her books I think I will make a video an entire video dedicated to her works because there is just so much to talk about and so much to unpack okay guys thanks for watching I hope you have a great week don't forget to subscribe for instant disappointment and I'll see you guys next week bye